And you can see why not giving up much there by Jasinski. Cade Van Raphorst is another good one, but this time Fennell gets a step and scores. But I think Fennell is a tough matchup for him. He is a big, physical, strong attackman right there, all left-handed. Van Raphorst cannot do anything about keeping him from the middle of the field and just the individual effort, which I think Ohio State's going to need a lot of today to be successful against this defense. We'll see another great coach, Tierney, coming up in game two. He's got 380 wins to his credit. Ohio State, oh, what a feed in front. And that's Eric Fennell. Lucas Buckley sets the pick behind the cage. And Jasinski then gets his hands free. It forces a slide from Duke from the crease. And then just a simple slip backdoor from Fennell in position. And owning the, the portions of the field that they want to own. Sometimes not allowing too many shots. Or if they do bad looking shots. And like you said, they could play such good one on one defense and they don't have to slide. Fennell again coming in front. The referees confer, count it. Hey, again, just a nice individual effort. He's too big, he's too strong. Done. Number 88 for Duke cannot contain him from a power perspective and he gets to the doorstep. He's going to finish that every time. Eric Fennell. Three goals already for Ohio. One minute man up opportunity for the Buckeyes. Here they go, they convert. What a play right in front. Right here, it's just a nice move through X. And there's really no cut. It's just a simple fill. And Shanks, back to back man up. Let's see if Duke can be a little bit more disciplined. Look out, Johnny Pearson. Up. And right here, it's just too easy. The passing lane. Unhindered with sticks. And just a nice over the top release from Johnny Pearson. Shot clock on to make Ohio State play a faster brand of lacrosse. The, the shot clock has been on twice for them today. I agree with that. I don't think there should have been any other shot clocks on. And here is Fennell. Take a look. Again, it all starts with him initiating it. X. Now leaning in. Oh, no, it's. To the back, I mean, it's a late hit oh. to the back. You can hear the contact. And again, nothing dirty about it, but just a little late. And that's a big body, two big bodies running towards one another. That's Thomas Zanker coming in from behind. You'll see 17 for Duke right there at the end. And it's tough. Quarterfinal round matchup right here from Hempstead, New York. Only three turnovers today by Ohio State. I mean, that's ludicrous. <laughs> the fact that they have 11 goals, they're pressing <laughs> shot after shot, goal after goal as they have there. I mean, they are, again, just another tremendous day for the senior there at the right place. Look at the quick hands after the shot and the save from Fowler, just in and out of his stick. Glad to see him back on the scoreboard. Five and two on the day.